<laughs> hey everybody, welcome to our house. It's been about eight months since we've been here and we just wanted to update our friends and family as to some of the changes that's been made. Uh, if Julie pans around, you can kind of see the difference in the yard. There used to be electric fence and cows running on the outside and big field of tall hay. So we cut all that down. I've been filling in low spots and trying to push the nice grass all the way out. It's about six acres of mowing. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And we put a swing up out there that the birds love to sit on. Bird poop. Uh, Ashley's birdhouse. Oh. Okay. Um. Come on, girls. Come on, let's go inside. Okay. There was nothing there before. So, built those six shelves on the outside. Uh, got some shiplap and put an electric fireplace in there. It's got a remote for it. And then got some furniture, rug. We had an ottoman at one time for about 10 minutes. It fell out of the back of my truck on the freeway. <laughs> and then we had no more ottoman. And on this side, just furniture, paint, ceiling fans are new. New curtains. I did the work, Julie did all the designing and binding and ordering. And then in the kitchen, it had that golden oak cabinets. So we took all the drawer faces and uh, cabinet doors off, painted all those. table that we brought with us from Hawaii. Koa. Koa wood all inlaid. Super crazy looking. Uh, new light. The table was came with us from Hawaii. The whiskey bar setup area. Then we have our doggy area. This is our dining area. Their dining area. <laughs> That's your dining area, Rocky. That's where they eat. Yeah. And those are our babies. Okay. And as we make our way through, guest bathroom, basic remodel, just painted the cabinets. Built a new countertop, backsplash, mirrors and shelves. And made it a little more modern. And the guest bedroom. Didn't do really work in here. Just new ceiling fan and a shelf. And then furnished it. <laughs> this is our Hawaii room. <laughs> yeah. Other bedroom we turned into an office. Just built this angle desk out of the same wood that I did the bathroom countertop in. Made an L-shaped desk. Built some some floating shelves, new ceiling fan, and a dog couch. That was gonna be our couch, but when we received the couch, it was about one hundredth of the size we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> Super tiny. <laughs> Perfect for the dogs. 
Perfect for the dogs to jump up on. <laughs> no. Once again, you'll see Julie's magic at work with her decor. That's Julie's morning devotion area. <laughs> I bought the dresser online. Dresser online. And then tried to match it with. Yeah. And then I built the bed. The headboard. Bed frame. Headboard. Had to cut holes in the wall to wire in those two uh, <laughs> side reading lamps. Uh, matched that paint color to the dresser. And bought some, what is that, one by eight shiplap. And couldn't get pieces long enough to make it look like they were seamless. So I had to sand them and make sure that the seams were good. So it just looks like one continuous piece. And then did that top piece, ran an LED strip in there. And then all those pictures are of all our trips, all our little vacations. Mm-hmm. And then we bought the nightstand from Ashley Furniture and it had silver drawer pulls. So I got the little leather little leather things from Amazon. Just stuck that in. And that little vase big vase thing was chrome. Just painted that one. Oh yeah, we brought that from home. And dog is playing. Coming to Julie's bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> uh, did a little bit of work in here. Built out the, all these cabinets. There was one base cabinet here that I was able to keep. All new countertops, new sink. The, I don't know, is this not rose gold? Um... Something Some brass. <laughs> Champagne. Champagne. Champagne bronze or something. Which we mm. still have to color this. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we got paint for it. Yeah. So the, Champagne bronze. the bathroom used to be like these oak cabinets. And there used to be a real tall one right here. And the bathroom was like blue or something. So took this out. New countertop. Built this across. And then for her... Refrigerator. Little makeup fridge. Built this little <laughs> cabinet. Little drawer. And then couldn't really figure out storage where this was going to be, where this was. So built this. Little pull out drawer. And then this drawer was just going to be dead space. So I came up with a drawer in a drawer. <laughs> so that that space isn't lost. And. Good job. Did the pull these cool blinds that you just lift up and pull around from blinds.com? Blinds.com, link in the description. <laughs> Not really. Uh, didn't really do much in the shower. No, Couple we still hooks. and we still got to paint the the shower head and, and all that. Yeah. And then up and coming, I think about the last project for inside is going to be. Shuffle the deck over here, move these over, and then we want to do a dog sink. washing station. Yes. Put a sink over here, just make this area more useful because it's kind of not, not all together yeah. yet. And I've been washing them in the kitchen sink, so it would be a lot better. So that's pretty much the inside of the house. Things that have been done. Don't really see anything else that we need to do in here. Nope. It's a little tiny chicken coop. And this little tiny chicken coop houses two little silky chicks. Our babies, our other babies. Hi, girl and boy. We think they're girl and boy. 
The biggest one's name is Uhtred. Uhtred from the Last Kingdom. And the little guy is Peanut. Peanut. We think she's a girl. Hopefully. Yeah, we don't know. Hi, babies. Hi. <laughs> He's got a big fur coat on. They couldn't really be hanging out with the other chickens because they're they're all the same age, but the other chickens are about twice as big. These guys grow slower and they keep getting picked on. <laughs> so Yeah. They're cute. Okay. And our dogs are doing pretty good with them. There's our yard. The garage is a work in progress. This is what we got. There's our... That's our super coop. To the super coop. Yeah, that's our little way to get down to the, the big chicken coop. Bigger chicken coop. It's a lot quicker and better than taking the tractor and you could fit everybody in it, not just one seater. And yeah. That's it. We did a lot. And the RV. Family and friends. Okay, and every, we'll do a video. Make sure up link in the description. Make sure to like and subscribe. <laughs> if you don't like this video, check out the video up in this corner or that corner, <laughs> down below, everywhere else. Links in the description. Uh,